Today we're gonna look at the best Kronker clients out there. So if you are excited to get above 1000 FPS in Kronker, wow. make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I have a download link in my Discord server, so make sure to join. The first 25 people that will join will get this Legends role, so be quick. The first client is Race Client, and this client is so fucking good. So look at the FPS I'm getting right now. This client is insane. Let's go to the client settings. Styles. The client has a built-in CSS. Normally you have just a click to play button right here. And you need to join to see what time is left. But now you can just see what time is. It's only 6 seconds so you know uh, it's better for me to just switch lobbies. Sky image. So this is is amazing if you want to custom sky you can just copy the fucking link of an image and you know yeah you have that sky it's it's easy as that i think i'm gonna take this sky from just <laughs> just <laughs> search minecraft sky so you just right click and copy image link you go back to your client and just paste it in right there and there you go you have your custom sky image you can link your Twitch and here are the golden settings of this client. FPS multiplier. You can multiply your FPS. That's crazy. See my FPS guys, it's not even normal. I have my sky set up as my previous sky. So I need to restart the client for the Minecraft sky to work. But I promise you guys, it will work if you just restart your game. Guys, look at my FPS. It's insane. The performance is good. Overall, this client is good. Let's look at the other clients. The next client is no client. And I promise you, this client will hype you up. So we started the no client and look at this. You have this nice overview from the news, the change logs, and just the partners of the client. So that's that's crazy. You can just go back to Hub. If you just want to search some items, you can just click on the Hub and, you know, you're, <laughs> you're in the Hub. So I'm just going to click play right here and the client will start up automatically. You'll see that this is not my usual CSS. If you go to your settings and you can just click on CSS right here you have all of these different CSS options I'm just gonna click random I'm gonna use this CSS because I think it's really clean and let's see what the null client settings are you can change your sky to whatever color you want it isn't that customizable as the as a previous client but it's still cool you can just Click on red and there you see you will have a red sky. I'm gonna keep my on black because I think it looks the best. Menu timer, we went over this already. Basic button, you can hide or show your exit button. It won't show on this CSS but it will show on your default or other CSSs. Hide pop-ups, that's very handy and hide ads, that's a crazy feature. The FPS I'm getting is still a lot. I'm getting around 6, 700. That's... <laughs> I promise you that, guys. That's not something I'll get on the default client. You'll get so much customization options with this client. That's insane. You can change your sky to whatever color you want. And, you know, the performance is fucking good. The next client we have is IDKR client. Normally I use IDKR client as my main client, but I'm really considering to change that really soon. So we are in IDKR client and let's look at the settings. Performance, this is all pretty default. You can, I would probably recommend to just check this on. This is all pretty default actually. It isn't that special, but the interface is the same as the previous. You can, you can see here right now, you can hide and show your accent button you can change that and you know 
just you have options. The cool part about IDKR client is you can use user scripts. User scripts are just scripts that people made. You can just download them and import them in IDKR client and it just gives you a bunch of cool features. So let's have a look how this client feels and plays. My FPS isn't that special. I'm getting around the same FPS I would get uh, from an other client. But something you need to keep in the back of your mind by IDKR client is that frames are really inconsistent. That means that you're sometimes you'll just get around 500 FPS and sometimes around 1000. So it's really inconsistent, but sometimes you'll get a lot of damn FPS. The client plays really smooth, really fine. I really like playing with it. But then again, I'm really thinking of switching from clients. The next client you'll have right here is Lev. I'm in the client right now, so let's see what client settings they have. This is all pretty basic, I'm not gonna go over it in depth, but here you have Discord. You can show whatever you want on here, but I'm just gonna leave everything on. Here we have graphics, unlimited FPS, that's default, but just keep it on. Here we have customize, easy CSS. This client comes with some CSS's, but not as much as the previous null client. We have hyper quick join, that's pretty insane you can select whatever lobby you want if if you want to play cranked ffa that's fine if you only want to play some fucking ffa just select it and you're good to go you can link your twitch and have all of these different twitch options so that is really cool i'm gonna try out one of the css's i'm going to go with this one right here so let's see how this client plays and feels. I'm getting around 5 to 600 FPS. That's not bad at oh shit. <laughs> so that's not bad at all. The CSS is built in and it's pretty damn decent to be a built in CSS. The next client is ghetto client. So let's have a look at the ghetto settings. Here are all the basic client settings. You have uncapped FPS, it's the same as unlimited FPS, you just need to check that on. Starting full screen, that's pretty handy, it speaks for itself. And you know, just most of these settings here speaks for itself. You have add-on settings, you can modify your add-ons, that's really cool, you can just download them. Visual settings, that's pretty cool, hide ads, we're gonna turn that on because we don't want the little ads right there. Loading screen background, it's the same concept as the sky but only with the background. So if you want to switch from a lobby to the background you will see that this image right there. Here are all the keybinds, what's cool about this client you can customize it as ever you want. These are all pretty cool features to have but I'm just gonna keep them like that. So let's have a look, look at my FPS right there. It's pretty damn insane. I'm getting around six, seven, eight hundred FPS sometimes. That's pretty cool. Not a lot of clients can do that. The performance is really good. I really like this client. It plays really smooth. I have a lot of FPS, so that's just great as well. So I think that was it for the video i think i'm gonna main race and null client from now on so i really hope i help you out don't forget to join my discord really quick because the first 25 people get this legends role see you guys